so this is the milling machine the main parts include a table and uh, then the column this vertical pillar is called the column and then you can see a steel rod like thing is there this is called arbor and at the center portion of that the tool is fixed there you can see the multi point cutting tool there because lot of cutting points are there for that one hence it is called as a multi point cutting tool and on the bed this portion is the bed and on the bed there exists a table and we can undergo the motion of the table by means of this flywheel by rotating this flywheel it will undergo the horizontal motion and then i am coming to the front view of this machine here you can see the two shafts are there one this shaft and another this shaft by using this lever you can rotate both shaft if you rotate this sh this shaft you can lift the bed upward there exists a screw mechanism underneath okay and next is on the top there exists another shaft for moving that bed sorry moving the table in the transverse direction that is towards that direction that is through this gateway it will travel and this is the root stock for holding the one end of the work piece and the work piece is usually held by means of the mandrel and the mandrel is usually placed in the chuck here and other end is to be fixed on this dead center and here we are rotating the work not the lot the work piece we are rotating the arbor for cutting operation just opposite to that of the lathe next is to position the work piece we have to use this dividing head lot of holes are there based on the angular movement we have to attain certain holes for that purpose the dividing head is placed there so these are the main parts of this uh, milling machine and you see all the axis movement of this milling machine that is x y z motion is possible in the case of a milling machine and you can see a swelling base also here just below the table you can see a swelling base by using that you can swell the table in x y direction so that we can undergo the angular cutting operation also for cutting helical gears and like that so that's all about the milling machine